What do a gun, a kick drum, and a snare drum have in common? Find out next on Music Surgery with Dr. Bob. Whether you're an artist, a producer, a musician, or a mixer, we all have one thing in common. The payoff to our song is the chorus. Here are three super simple tricks that'll help your chorus explode up from the verse level, guaranteed to make you big bags of money. Okay, I'm going to start this at the end of the previous chorus. It'll come down into a verse and then pop into the next chorus. Here we go. Okay, as you can see, our drums in the verse don't have all of these extra samples. Meaning that because so much of the music we make now is sample-based or time-based or VST instrument-based, even when we have real players on tracks like this, we have to create new ways of making dynamics in tracks in addition to the dynamics that the players play. So what I've added to make the choruses pop more from the verses are extra kick drums, extra snares, and some extra ambience. So let me show you the different sets of kicks and snares that I've added in my chorus apart from my regular drums to make it bigger. Here's the first example. So, extra kick, extra snare, also with a lot of live room ambience. What's this track? This one's Addictive Drums. A little bit of ambience. Shorter room ambience and a Tama Bell Brass snare, a Craviato Custom snare, and a Gretsch kick. Next. A real mid-range throaty snare. Bring up the bottom end of the snare with a lot of... right about 165, 166 to give it some more weight. Also, we have some subby, subby kick drum, just for more weight in the super low end. Next. Okay, this is for a lot of snap, a lot of high end on the kick. Super bright, punchy. All right, just for some more energy, more of a stereo ambient mic for the snare, and um, it's got Chris Lord Algae's 251 room preset on it with a little bit extra stuff. What else? Very throaty snare, really super throaty. A little more ping. Sometimes when more guitars come in and your chorus gets crowded, that kind of ping will really, really bring out 
the snare drum. Sounds terrible by itself. And another snare that's kind of uh, around 170. Give it a little more boost. So, all together, the extra kick snares in the chorus are this. A lot of ambience, a lot of extra slap, a lot of extra compression just to make the drums bigger, make them snap more, dialing in frequency ranges in each one of these samples or these VST instruments to give it that extra boost, more punch, more dynamics from just the verse. Verse drums sound great. It needs to come down. It needs to go somewhere between the choruses to make the chorus bigger you can't have a whole song of drums this big or you got nowhere to go we have somewhere to come down but in the chorus we have somewhere to go up let's listen to the transition Like I said, the drums sound great in the verse. They give us somewhere to go in the chorus. Don't be afraid to add extra kicks, extra snares, some extra ambience, some extra room sounds to make your chorus pop. Now, one more thing that I've added, this is an old Mutt Lang trick, to the top of the chorus is a tuned down gunshot that sounds like this. <laughs> How nice, Sumner. You found a kazoo sample. Could you please roll the footage? Thank you. A tuned down gunshot that sounds like this. It sounds ridiculous by itself, but putting it on the downbeat of the chorus accentuates. Boom. We're here. We're at the chorus. Listen. Now, obviously, that's really loud and everything's soloed up. Let me turn it down a little. Without it. It's very subtle, especially when all the other instruments are in there. But again, it anchors the beginning of the chorus down. We've arrived. Boom. The chorus is popping. When all of the vocals, all the keyboards, all the guitars, everything else is in the song, you don't hear this as much as you feel it. But it definitely announces that this is the top of the chorus. I've used these three tricks for years. Extra snares, extra kick, and the gunshot sample. Guaranteed to make you big bags of money. Dr. Bob, did you just use the three Dr. Bob tips guaranteed to make your chorus explode and make big bags of money? I just used them in a song right now. Well, here you go. A big bag of money. Thanks, Dr. Bob. You're welcome, citizen. Now they're your tricks, too. And if you don't have a tuned down gunshot sample, here you go. As always, thanks for watching, and please keep the comments or suggestions for future episodes coming. And I'll see you the next time the Dr. Zoom. Gee, thanks, Dr. Bob. You're welcome, citizen. <laughs> that was perfect. Was that good?